Hi my loves, welcome back. First of all, I just want to take a really quick minute to say I have missed y'all more than I can even say. Um, I'm having a problem, my camera's not working. So basically, I am filming with my phone right now. So hopefully, my mouth is not moving weird with my words. Okay, so we're just going to go um, for it. Basically, this video right now is just like my favorites. I didn't do July's favorites, so I'm going to kind of do what I did with my last favorites. I'm going to just do all of my July's and August. Sorry. <laughs> See, when you're on your phone, even notifications show. So I'm going to put all of my August, July and August, into one video of my favorites. I'm going to kind of try to go through this as fast as I can so I don't run out of storage room here on my phone. But I do want to let you all know I love you, I miss you, and I miss making tutorials and get ready with me videos, and I really miss my vlogs. So hopefully sooner rather than later, I'll have all that fixed and we can get back back to basics you know what I mean okay okay this is gonna be my first like which I got for my birthday which is an oldie but a new new newbie for me okay this semi sweet toothpaste chocolate bar it's been out for a hot minute I know my loves I know but this girl right here did not have that so yeah it's new to me the colors, my loves, the colors are gorgeous, okay? I really like that peanut butter color um, and the truffle for, like, to deepen the out. It's not on the second, but when I really want to get, you know, looking hot. And, mm, it smells like chocolate. Where can you go wrong, my loves? Where can you go wrong? I don't think you can. So yeah, I've been loving that semi-sweet chocolate bar by Too Faced. While we're talking about Too Faced, I've been liking the Too Faced No Bunny Illuminating Bronzer. So I will open that for you. I'm wearing that right now. Just right now. I'm looking at it like you can really see it. But um, yeah, this is basically what it looks like. And I just take my brush, swirl it in there, and just, you know, put it on. And it puts a pretty, um, I don't know, like a glow. Hmm. Like a glow to the face. I don't know. But loving it. Loving it. And actually a real sweetheart. Um, she, my girlfriend, she's a sweetie pie. She got me that. Um, I am still for um, highlight. I am still loving this by Pure Elevation. I told you all on my last favorites, but yeah, I got to put that in again. And now, if you want to see all the swatches on this, go ahead and check out um, through my content. I believe it's on a video um, under my Julie thing. Uh, um, I believe it's under giveaways and rising lashes. So check for that. I do swatches on that as well. While I'm speaking of rising lashes, yes, honey, these lashes are awesome. They are a game changer, at least for me. Um, I really love them. And she, this line, if you go to at rising lashes on Instagram, that's where I found this company. She's awesome. She has four styles. I think she has her Fox Meats one out, so I think she has five right now. Um, but yeah, they are just beautiful lashes. And the lashes, you can barely see the band, and I think that is why I fell so in love with them. Um, but yeah, 
You guys should check them out if you like lashes. Now, I don't wear lashes on a daily. I don't even have them on right now. You all probably can tell I don't have them on. Um, but when I do or I want to, you know, get really fixed up or really glammed up, yes, honey, rising lashes. Um, Too Faced, melted by Too Faced. This is what the packaging looks like. This color is beautiful. This is more of a matte. Or this is a matte. I'm sorry. It's a matte. Um, I'm really loving it. It's not too much of a pop of color, which is always good because I don't always want to have like a bright lip. Um, but it's very, I've, I've used it with a heavy eye as well as, um, a not so heavy eye, you know, with a basic eye look. I tend to, if I don't have a lot going on with my eyes and I just have like a very sheer, um, shadow or maybe no shadow and I just go for some mascara I like to have a pop of color on my lip and vice versa. So if I'm heavy on the eye, I like to go with a light lip. If I'm not heavy, I like to go with a pop of mm, something, something. You know what I mean? But yeah, so Too Faced Melted, excuse me, matte. And that is in the color Queen Bee. I don't know, ladies and gents, but I'm loving it. Loving it. Um, for my birthday, uh, my sister got me this Urban Decay lipstick. I tried it on. I, keep, I have a live where I put this on. <laughs> but this color is beautiful, and I'm really wanting to wear this for, um, you know, fall, Christmas, the holidays. Y'all can see that color. Here, I'll swatch it for you, my loves. So it's like a deep, um, I don't know, I want to say a deep burgundy red. I don't know, it's really pretty, and I'm definitely going to be wearing it for the holidays. For sure. Okay. You will see this girl in that. So if my sister's watching, thank you, sister. I love you. And since we're talking about lips, let me get in and say, I need to try to make this short, guys, so it doesn't run out of time. Um, I got these two NYX um, liners, lip liners that I picked up. One's in suede. So this one would be suede. And this is, I believe this is Roll the World. Run the World. It's not a song. Is that from Beyonce? Roll the World. Anyway, oh, sorry, I got sidetracked. <laughs> yes, but this one is Run the World. I love it. I think it's really pretty. This one is in flower. This is not the suede one. This is just a regular NYX pencil. Um, but I've noticed, like, if I really mess around with my lips and such, this one's needs sharpened. But you can definitely get a very, very pretty ombre lip with this and maybe put a little bit of lip gloss on the top. And let me tell you, loves, yeah, it looks good okay good so you all know by now if you watch my favorites you watch any of the hauls I posted where I bought makeup you will know that I love the met and walk mm. we're gonna go back scratch that <laughs> I love the wet and wild mega last 12 hour wear eyeliner loves I don't know, like, if it's just me. Is it just me? If it is, let me know. But if I can spend $2 on an eyeliner that is really going to stay, I'm talking 
it rides out with me from 8 a.m. to say nighttime when I'm home. <laughs> you best better believe your bottom buck, your girl's doing it. Okay? I'm going to do it. And I have done it. And I'm going to continue doing it. <laughs> so, $2, my love. You can get this in Walmart, Target, Dollar General. Sorry, you can't get it at Dollar Tree. Never say never because you never know what they're going to put in there. But wherever you see Wet n Wild products, $2. $2. I, I'm like, right now this is my holy grail because like, I'm like, I have one that's not even open, my loves. Because that's how much I love it. Like, I need backup. I don't want to be without it. You guys know I love Liberty. That lipstick from um, Makeup Revolution that I got in Ulta. Right now, I am wearing the Matte Blissful. Okay, this is from Milani. And I don't know. Y'all seen me wear it before. I'm wearing it again. And actually, I'm wearing it with one of those lip liners. And it's an oldie but a goodie, okay? I'm telling you. Same thing with this. Oldie but a goodie. It might be old to y'all, but let me tell you, I love it. I love it. I want to get all three of those chocolate bars now. The original and the other one. Just to, you know, play. What girl doesn't love to play in makeup? Um, you guys know I bought the, the concealer from Makeup Revolution and Ulta probably about what now? I want to say two months. I don't know, but $7, okay? And, honey, this is great. And I still have product. I still have product. I'm going to get another one, but I still have a lot of product, okay? This is awesome. If you are like me and you cannot afford to go, you know, buy the $27, $28 Shape Tape by Tarte, I highly recommend this. I have tried so many different um, concealers, and I'm telling you, loves, this is awesome. This is, to me, now this is my opinion, though. To me, this is the same as the Tarte Shape Tape. I mean, you're working with basically almost, it feels like the same formula. It's not, obviously, or maybe it's just the name, but... To me, it's awesome. And let me tell you, like I've told you in the past, you do, I mean, you can do, it depends on your age, okay? You could do your regular, um, where you want to highlight and conceal. Um, but what I do is I don't have to put that much. I have pigmentation under my eyes, as you all know, if you watch my videos. But I'm looking in the phone, sorry. Um, but if I put it right up in here, and a little here, a little here, and a little here, and I blend it out with my beauty blender, perfect. Because a little goes a long way. So I would highly recommend it. I can't say not to. Let's talk, my loves. Masks. Hello, oh, well. <laughs> um, one of my girls here, um sent me this. Thank you, Tara. I love you, girl. Um, but I am loving face masks. I have loved to use face masks for a while now. It's been a hot minute. Um, but I'm really looking forward to use this 24 karat gold one. I don't know. What's your favorite mask? If you do like the sheet mask. I mean, look at this. $2. I mean, how can you not? How can you not pick one up? Brightening lemon mask. Ooh, it's got lemon. I just noticed that. Maybe tonight calls for one. But anyway, living for them. Another hmm, color pop. Loves color pop. This is another shadow that I have been loving. Um, 
This is more of a, to me it looks more of like a glitter on the eye. I have some on now actually, but it's mixed with some shadow. So yeah, hmm. I'm not sure if you're going to see much, but okay. Anyway, this is in birthday cake. I got this on my birth on the day of my birthday, okay? My friend sent me these. So, it looks like this inside. Very pretty. Don't mind my nails, my loves. I will get that done soon. Let me put it over here. Oh my goodness. Do you see the shimmer and the just the shine in that? I don't know, but loving it, living for it, love it, want more, gonna get more. <laughs> you guys probably think I'm cuckoo. Anyway, color pop in birthday cake. Loving that color. Um, this is by Bliss Lemon and Sage Body Butter. I can't say enough for this. It smells so delicious, loves. It also is so soft, so soothing. I mean, it's body butter. What can you say? You know, it's awesome. But the smell. Mmm. I wish you guys could smell it. It is just amazing in the formula. It's so perfect. I'm going to just rub some on my hands. So by Bliss, I highly recommend that. Um, and then what was the other thing I had? Oh my goodness. You all know how I love my Morphe palette. I have a Morphe palette, for those of you that don't know. It is Fall Into the Frost. It's gorgeous. Um, I have worn it quite a few times. This is a box for it. The 35F Fall Into Frost. 35 shades on this baby. You have like seven mattes. The rest are shimmers. Um, and I do want to cry. I can't even flip it. Mm -hmm. You guys already know by the way I just did that. I know. I wanted to cry too. Let me just tell you loves that what happened was I keep my um, like most of my palettes, other palettes, I always usually keep them in the box. And they're in bubble wrap as well, you know. And I want to keep all my palettes in good condition, you know. Who, who wouldn't? So, I'm taking this palette here out of my closet, one of my closet shelves. And... Let's just say I almost stopped. I did stop breathing for a, split, for a split second. I knew I broke it, and um, I did not want to flip it over and pick it up. I was really scared, of course, because I love this palette. Sure enough, two shadows broke all over the floor, all over my tile. All out the sides of the palette and I'm thinking OMG right what happened was is when I pulled it out it came out of this bottom sleeve and it wasn't secure as I thought I thought I had it facing this way I had it facing the opposite so when I pulled it out it just went everywhere I'm gonna try to show you Okay, this is probably the best I can get it, but this one and this one went right out the pan. Oh, I really lost this one. Um, yeah, so these seven on the bottoms are mattes, obviously. The rest of these are all shimmers. I mean, they're absolutely gorgeous. 
I love this palette. I highly, highly, highly recommend it. Um, I think it's absolutely gorgeous. The shimmers are like no other. I mean, let me try to swatch one for you. But it's messy now. Okay, here's one. Uh, I'll put right over here. Look at that. One swatch. So, I mean, you can obviously build these babies up if you wanted, but you don't need to. I mean, they're just, they're just perfect like that. So, yeah. I was crying over that palette, but yeah, I mean, these, this ColourPop, though, I'm in love with. Sorry, my fingernails aren't green. They're holographic, chrome, and they kind of look that way in the light. But yeah, I love that color pop, that Urban Decay lipstick, I believe in Bruce, B-R-U-I-S-E, um, is going to be beautiful for fall and as well like Christmas. It's going to be a pretty holiday color. And this is just one of the shimmers out of that Fall into Frost 35F palette. This is the only palette I have that does not have names, so I can't really say if you have it which color it is, but I will go ahead and point which one that was. Second row from the bottom. Right here, my loves. So if you want to take a look at that. Um, I also have this. This is by Profusion. I haven't used it yet, but one of my subscribers sent it to me. She's a sweetheart. She is like such a beautiful, beautiful soul. She sent this to me. Now, they have these colors in it. It's hard for me to tell because it has a peeling on it. Um, I'm loving this color. I'm loving this color, this color. I don't know about you guys if you like to play with different looks. I may not go out in it, but I definitely want to try playing with colors when I'm at home. So I'm very excited about trying this. These are the colors on the back of it. And I'm excited about trying it. So my loves, that's basically all my favorites. Ooh, it's getting high, so I'm going to go ahead. It's 23 minutes almost. I'm sorry if I'm like, you know, stuttering a little bit. Right now my feet are asleep. <laughs> and also, I'm just, like, not used to filming on my phone because sometimes you can, you know, under see me moving my lips with the words, and sometimes you can't. Sometimes it just turns off. It just does its own little thing. Um, and my poor camera, yeah. So I'm still waiting to hear from Home Shopping Network. That is where my parents got me that camera. Hopefully I can get it fixed soon. If not, I don't know. I'm going to cry. Um, I will probably be on live later. I will be on my Chromebook. And um, that doesn't have a bright picture. So... That's the only bad thing about that. So if you do go, you know, let me know. Let me know you watched this and came to see my live so I know. And um, I look forward to talking to you all later. So anyway, my loves, that is going to conclude this July and August favorites. A lot of um, other stuff I got. Um that I haven't been using too long. I have not put in here. So I could put, you know, in September's favorites. And I still like to, you know, work with the products to see if I really like it before I tell you that, oh my God, I'm in love with it. Or this is beautiful. Or the pigments or the, you know what I mean? The formula is awesome. I don't want to tell you that unless I 
you know, legit have used them and fell in love with them myself. So I am going to close now. I hope you all have a beautiful, beautiful and blessed evening. And until next time, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.